let me transfer you. Switch to Farm Bureau Insurance today and get real service instead of getting really tangled up. For auto, home, life, and health, get the membership advantage. Get Farm Bureau Insurance. Uh, I would say yes. I mean, we do have uh, a lot of inexperienced players stepping up this year, but I wouldn't say that is going to hold us back because um, every year we go through camp the same way. The same players go through the same reps, and right now we're looking good. Uh, like you said, we have a lot of experience at uh, wide receiver, which uh, gives us the ability to make plays downfield. Um, but once again, you need the offensive lineman to get it uh, to the receivers. And right now, that's our focus. And right now, they're accomplishing what the coaches are demanding from them. What's your take on the quarterback situation? I mean, we have two of the best quarterbacks in the CA much less the whole our whole division. So right now they're competing. They're going hard every day. And I'll be proud to work with either one of them. How was your relationship with Aaron Brown since he came in? Obviously coming in in the wintertime, so we have that whole semester with the team and then the summertime and then that. Um, at first it wasn't um, often that we talked, but now since he stayed here this summer and I stayed here this summer, We've uh, worked seven on seven on occasions, and we've uh, communicated on s numerous times. So I say we're de uh, developing a good relationship. Trey, how have they improved since spring? Both quarterbacks. Uh, their ability to read the diff uh, the coverages, the defense, uh, their ability to take control of the huddle when they're in. Uh, it's kind of hard because. Um, when you have a quarterback who has the job, he gets most of the reps. So they're uh, taking their opportunities and doing what they're supposed to do, which is leading us to get better every day. How important is that aspect, as you said, taking, taking control of the huddle? How important is that for a quarterback? Uh, it's really important. Uh, the supporting cast in the huddle, we can hoorah and yell and rev everybody up all we want. But you got to look in the eyes of the quarterback and know you're going to be all right. And with these guys, they're starting to develop that. How important do you think it is for, for them to kind of make a decision and, and kind of get you get the unit familiar with one guy and get him more reps and timing and all that stuff? How important is it for you, do you think? Uh, I think it's important. But uh, at the same time, the coaches, they know what they're doing. Um, they know the route that they're going. And like I said, they're both splitting reps. And like I said, they're taking advantage of every opportunity. Um, like you, the more reps you get, the better you become. But right now, this, that's not the situation. Was there a big adjustment, you think, for Aaron to go from like the top echelon of Division One football to the top echelon of FCS football? Have there been? Are there a lot of differences at this level that maybe he took a while to get used to? I wouldn't say there was a big difference. The only thing I would say is maybe he uh, had a little adjusting to do with the offensive linemen because we were so young in the spring. I would say that much. Uh, but as far as football goes, it's football is football. doesn't matter what level you're on. I mean, my opportunities to play with Eric Ward, he was uh, developed. So, you know, he had more control. He knew the offense. He knew, how, he knew what he was doing. Um, there's no bad difference. It's just different. Eric Ward was a different guy. He was unique, as well as John Lobb and Aaron Corp. They're all different. 
and they do what they're supposed to do the best way they know how. What did you like about Saturday's scrimmage? You have two more before Virginia. How far away do you think you guys are from being game ready? Um, from Saturday's performance, um, I was happy with the ability to move the ball. We weren't able to move in the spring, so I was really happy with that. As far as game ready, we may not be game ready at this moment, but we will be in the direction we're going and the improvements and the gains that we're making. We like it. Um, underdogs, you know, we like being looked over. Gives us the ability to show up every day like we're supposed to, taking it one week at a time and handling our business. Did it sting at all? Because you guys haven't been six in the conference probably at any point in the last five years. It didn't sting one bit. Uh, it's expected. You know, we don't want anything handed to us. Uh, we only had a couple of returning starters on offense and a couple on defense. So that's expected. But it's our job to build up, not look back. Uh, we were picked sixth in the conference. Okay. We'll show up and try to be number one every week.